Hello, my name is Farman, and welcome back to episode two of our Let's Play on British Farm Styles map, whatever it's called. Um, right. So we are back. As you can see, we have a face cam. Now I'm looking at my other screen and pointing, but the face cam is there. Um, hang on, let me just lock my chair. There we go. You can kind of lock my chair to stop it squeaking and rocking. So we have one. What's this? This field's going in soya beets. Soya beans or beets or whatever you want to call them. Combine. So, there's already this field here. Field 13's already got soya bees in. Soya bees, beans, whatever. Um, I'm going to do just three fields of that because it's it looks like a good money crop. It is. Is it up or down at the moment? I've gone up to 740, so the next best thing would have been sunflowers. So we're going to try and do them too. They are the new crops within the game, so we're going to get on with that. But today we want to get on with this tractor. Ooh, we need to press R. Now I think we're going to take a load of barley first of all. Right, so we'll put the cover back on. Get in the cab. Oh, I don't quite know where the shop is. Now, if we come out of our yard and turn, turn this way. Right. Um. So we are going to be selling the New Holland trail behind mower this episode as well. Um. What else are we going to be doing? Just sort of selling the crop. Just trying to make a bit of money uh, for when the soybeans are done. Because we need to fertilise both the sets of fields. So we're going to have to you know, do a lot of work. Mm. Oh, it did not like that at all. Could have probably put the 8340 on this. Instead of the drop nose massy. Mm. Uh, patch, what was it? 1.3.1 1 has come out. I haven't got it yet, so I'm gonna get it after this video. And we'll have a look. Now it does say there's only one place to sell it. So that's the biogas. So that means the only one place is this place here. If I remember rightly. Um, Alright, so here's where you sell your pigs as well. I have no idea what they're talking about. Yes, we are about to try and reverse a dolly trailer. Now, the trick with reversing the dolly is not to look at the back end, is to just look at this point in the first point of uh, where it steers. And that's how I've managed to do it all these times. Well, we're not going to be keeping this trailer for very long because it is an annoyance to try and store the grain. Right, so the price for barley is actually down at the moment, but I'm not too fussed about that. Oh, 
that's that. We're gonna have to listen to that every time we come here. Right, I think we'll take a load of canola as well. I think we'll just take one of each, and then we'll take them, bring the mower up here on the eight three forty because we want a front front mower, not a uh, not a side mower. Well, at this moment we don't, but mm, Pepsi. Uh, so we've got to the. T5 is uh, putting the soya beans in the ground. We are trying to get it. We are going to save for a uh, cutter to cut the um, sunflowers, but then we need to save for a cedar that will do that as well because this cedar we've got at the moment won't plant sunflowers. Um, and they are making the most money right now. But soya beans do make a good profit. Oh, um. Uh, another mod that I've put in is lower animal prices, so they're down to what FS15 was, which is 2,500 for cows, and you know, which is really going to help us out. I think the prices for animals in this game was way too steep for really, for really what it is. Um, I could be wrong; other people might disagree with me, but personally, I thought they were a bit steep. So we've uh, just tweaked. Well, we haven't tweaked them; we've just downloaded a mod that allows you to do that. We'll get the pipe over that if we can just. Just wait there. Okay, so he's doing a pretty good job of this. Like I said, he's got the other field to do as well. Which doesn't take very long with that. It, I just wanted to keep a bit of grain behind for, you know, getting us started in the, uh, what's it, so at least if we were going to run out of money, we wouldn't run out totally, we had a bit, we had a bit of a backup, basically. Um, the camera will be changed, I'm going to get a HD one, this is my pretty bad one that I use at this moment in time. Um, that's going to change, we will get that upgraded. Um, So yeah, the, the, the first episode got some pretty good reviews. I'm pretty happy with the uh, what's it what he got, so that's good. Right, I know this is not the most thrilling of things to watch, but it's got to be done. Um. So the trailer we're going to go for is probably the Mar is probably a Marshall or another one, just one that isn't dollied or articulated or whatever you want to call it, or has a dolly if you know what I mean, because they are the pain to just as you can probably tell they're a pain to reverse like they are. Now we have to listen to the people talking again. So I'm going to try and hurry this bit up. Faster. As you can probably tell, we're in the new room because we've got a white thing behind us. Normally, there's my bed behind me, but there is not now. Right, 5,881 for that one. So we're only at 20,000, which isn't bad. That's pretty good. We are we are on hard difficulty, so we aren't going to make too much money. The soya beans should rake in a fair bit. But like I said, we're going to have to sort of do what we've done now and save and plant a load of crop in. I know I'm just sort of, at this moment, just planted three fields of the same crop. But I kind of just want to get money going. Uh, 
and that really for me is probably the only way it's really going to work um, and then we will start animals I think we're going to start with sheep because they're the easiest to look after sheep then pigs and then get into cows because the cows are the hardest and we need the most money to start them um, pigs need a lot um, of feed and that to get them really going but apparently they make a fair, quite a bit when you sell them so we'll have to do that and I've got an itch in my ear Ooh. adjust my headset my headphones so we're gonna just so that guy should be alright in there I think we'll take another load or we might actually take the 8340 with the uh, mower on the back and get that sorted and the reason I am selling it is because we are going to attempt to try and get some of these silage pits a bit full. Um, or it's, or when we get the sheep in, because the sheep aren't too far off actually being able to come. And we need a loader bracket for this uh, 8340 as well. Not loader bracket, an actual loader. And that growling you can hear every so often is the G27. Well, as you can tell, this tractor has very low hours on it. It's not. I have, I don't actually use it at all because the other two are more useful because they are a lot smaller. So it's pointless putting this much horsepower on the field. Um, and we might need this tractor. As you can tell, it's the loader one, so we're going to need it at some point. And I just clip through that wall. <laughs> mm. So it's, it's quite a nice map. I am enjoying this. Um, I'm, I'm hopefully all of you lot are as, as well. Or whoever is actually watching my videos enjoying this. Um, So hopefully we should have some multiplayer videos out at some point. Come on. That is... Because um, there are quite a few people now that are in the multiplayer uh, server. So we can kind of just jump into that and crack on. Um, which would be pretty good. Because then we can just sort of drive about and see what everyone else is doing and then if we need help doing silage or something you don't realize how far it is to the shop I, I think I'm taking the really long way not just accidentally So, make sure the A340 is clear. Can you customize it? No, there are no customizers. There we go, gone. Oh, what's in here? Oh, this little butte. Seen better days. Is that two seats in there? Mm. Right, so let's sort our tractor out. So we need what's 5,400 for that. We are going to need a set of pallet forks for the wool. Um, yes, set of pallet forks for the wool. And all we need now is the front mower. So we're going to try and go for a cheap one. 11,000, eh? 11,000 it is. You pay the, pay the price, but we can... Oh. So we've spent almost what we made earlier just in new vehicles. But at least they're bought now. And I need to set up my joystick because I've actually inverted it accidentally. The game didn't invert it, I just inverted it myself. 
So down, so pushing towards the screen is up and pulling back is down, which I don't want. I want pulling back is up and then pulling, pushing towards the screen is down. I can see this is not going to be very fun. And we're going to put this mower on the back and get it home and then I think we're going to take this tractor out mowing and picking up. There we go, that's up. Because once we, I'll sell, I'll sell the rest of this grain off screen. Um, once these, because these fields are, nearly cl are pretty close to being done. Well, one of them is. We've only got one more to do after that, and then we should, they should be done. So we'll get them finished. Uh, get the soybeans and get them fertilised. Um, I'll probably just sell it as we need it, and then if we've got any left over, I'll just completely sell everything that we've. If there's any left over, um, because it does take a bit of fertilise fertilisers to do. I know field thirteen you can do with one tank of fertiliser, and then the other two take. I think it's two. So we're gonna have to do them with two, obviously. And it's going to slow us, well it's going to slow down a bit. And then if there's any money left, if we'll just sort of take the profits right down and then we'll steadily bring them back up with the grain. And then eventually we will get a rhythm. We, I want field 11 or 12 at the next, at the side of us here because they are quite big. Um, and look like they could hold, look like quite a lot of money can be made by them. And they're quite square as well, which means hide worker is going to like them. Right. So if we just find a space to drop these, I'm just going to drop both these loader things here. Next to the muck heap. That's inverted as well, I don't want it that way. Or do I? Quickly attach this. Because we, we have got a bit of time left, so we can at least make a start mowing. <clears throat> And then we'll just quickly have a look on the how the cedar is doing and yeah, we can't really make a start, can we? Because we haven't got any sheep. I'll tell you what, we can start putting some in them silage pits over there and just have some saved up. Just wait here. He's okay. Quick drink. Right around the corner. Now we're going to do field two, which is actually quite a big grass field, which I'm quite glad they gave us, actually. It is given to you. Well, actually, you own all the fields in the entire map when you start the game. I've just taken out... I've just gone into the XML and edited all the fields that I didn't want, that I hadn't, because I'd actually put a crop into field 5, 6 and 13, so it was like, well I want to just keep them because there's already money in there. Right, so if we lower that, fire that up, fire the mower up. Oh, is it cutting? Yes, it is. Yeah, that's a bit. That's a bit atrocious uh, mowing there. Cutting straight across. So yeah, this is what I mean. This is what we're going to do for a little bit until we get a bit more money. Um, yeah, it's it's going to work. I mean, it is quite a slow process because the tractor isn't going very quick and the mower is not putting loads out because it's not cutting very wide but still that's good enough 
and you just take corners quite gently with it. Oh, so you can cut about 13 mile an hour with this mower. Right, we'll just do one go around and then I'll I'll do it. I might just, just keep mowing and filling the silage pit up because there is no other reason. There's no, I've got nothing else to do because uh, both the, all the fields are cultivated. Uh, we're just waiting for that one to be seeded and I want to fertilise them all as one well in one go, like I said. And uh, then I'll let uh, have a look how much money we've got and just get rid of all the crops and just sell them all. Because that's just that's just going to be the easiest thing to do because then we can keep up the money because we are we're on 14,000 so we're not doing too bad. We did get to 32,000. We are going to have to buy that mower back but I might go for a butterfly set because we've already got the front one we might as well just buy the back ones uh, and that they'll cut a lot wider which is going to save a lot of time and that's just for making hay bales and stuff like that so we'll do one cut around and then uh, one cut around and then that'll do wage payments so you can see it's not too expensive um, at night I will stop the workers actually going and just go through the night well actually they should be finished by night time because apparently they get paid more once they work in the night in the actual game so it's uh, it's quite weird right so anyway um, so this is the new piece of kit we've got it's working pretty well we're doing okay with it I'm just I just want to get all the grass I mean because by the time them fields are ready we'll be able to just fast forward time and this will all grow again anyway so we'll kind of be just be able to just go back round it again and I want to get sheep next episode as well or even but we'll have to see how much money we've got so anyway thank you all so much for watching leave a like down below if you enjoyed subscribe more today and I shall see all of you in the next video happy farming Ooh, good. goodbye